Well, welcome to the Cincinnati Zoo and Botanical Garden. Uh, this is our Rockdale Academy Urban Learning Garden. And what we wanted to promote here is the fact that, you know, in order to get, uh, you know, really good pollination, you need to have great pollinator plants uh, in your garden. And one of the best things that we can do for our garden is to, you know, plant a wide variety of mix of, you know, trees, shrubs, perennials, annuals, so we can bring in a wide diversity of pollinators to the garden that'll help us pollinate our food crops. The food crops that we have here in the garden are numerous. We have uh, many different trees that are native to this area. For instance, uh, persimmon, pawpaw, uh, amelanchier, uh, and then also some that maybe aren't native, like the apples, uh, you know, and, and some of the common fruits that you're, you're used to eating, peaches, uh, plums, things like that. Uh, but then there's also uh, plants like raspberries and blueberries that you could grow in your garden. Uh, but all of our food crops, uh, I would say, uh, you know, many of them are pollinated uh, by insects. And without bringing in a wide diverse of insects, you know, pollination just isn't as strong. And, uh, you know, a lot of times on major crops, you have to literally bring in colonies of honeybees to do the pollination. And what we're finding out more and more is that our native pollinators can do that pollination. It's just through all the construction and all the uh, urban sprawl that we have, um, we're losing our urban pollinator uh, plants. So part of uh, the zoo's mission is to bring a lot more pollinator plants to the urban landscape. My main message is let's plant a wide diversity of flowering plants. And it's not just the big bumblebees and the honeybees that you see on your landscape flowers that we're concerned about. It's all those minor bees, all those other pollinators that pollinate our crops and, and pollinate our plants that, that we really have to be concerned with. And again, diversity is the key. Thank you very much.